The Six Nations Championship kicks off this weekend with the winners widely touted to emerge from the realm of last men standing. Injuries have wreaked havoc with most squads but some of the favorites are feeling it more keenly than others. It should make for a more open tournament especially after double defending champions. England have had to plug holes left by around a dozen absentees. The game is increasingly taking its toll on its top practitioners but it is hardly surprising given the relentless and, in some cases combined grind of the top 14 the Premiership the Pro 14 and European clubs competitions. What has compounded matters especially for the teams from the home unions is the fact that their top players were engaged in a grueling tour of New Zealand with the British and Irish Lions in the middle of last year. Ireland are missing 11 players including celebrated stars like Jamie Heaslip and Sean O'Brien. Scotland are without 10 players including Richie Gray Wales are missing 10 including Sam Warburton Toby Flatow Reese Webb Reese Priestland and Dan Bigger while France are missing 9 frontline players including the like of Wesley Fofana and Morgan Parra. Despite having to dig deep into their reserves England will still start as favorites. The restoration of their reputation over the last two years is a task that coach Eddie Jones has warmed to. Under his tutelage they will start this campaign with the momentum of consecutive Six Nations triumphs as well as the wider context of 22 wins from 23 starts. Along the way they have also successfully incorporated young talent as was evidenced with their 2-0 test series win in Argentina in June last year. They are expected to beat Italy at a canter in Rome on Sunday. Since the start of last year Italy have won just one of their 11 tests. Ireland go into their clash against France in Paris buoyant mood following their successes last November. They are second favorites and are expected to make a winning start against a French outfit that hasn't won a test since their last match in last year's Six Nations. New France coach Jacques Brunel has some exciting youngsters in his squad but the tricolors too have suffered at the cruel hand of injury. Scotland improved immeasurably under former coach Vern Cotter and Gregor Townsend has kept them on the same path over the last year. They travel to Cardiff where they'll meet an injury-ravished Wales who are missing several first-team regulars. Scotland dark horses to go on and win the championships beat Wales at Murrayfield last year and don't bet against them winning away from home this time. This weekend's fixtures, Saturday 3rd of February Wales v Scotland, Cardiff, 4.15 p.m. France v Ireland, Paris, 6.46 p.m. Sunday 4th of February Italy v England, Rome, 5 p.m.